We are now approaching Shenfield. <laughs> Good start. <laughs> Change for oh. TFL rail. We'll wait. Good Please morning. mind the gap between the train and the platform edge. Good morning everyone. So today me and my mum are off to London. It's my mum's birthday week so we thought we'd start it out great with going to London for a couple of days. So I thought I would bring you guys along because I really enjoyed filming the London vlog that I did a couple months ago and I love to re-watch that and um, like for the memories and stuff so I thought I'd vlog again. We're currently on the train from Chelmsford to Liverpool Street. I've got a few surprises planned for my mum because it's her birthday. It's actually quite funny because me and my mum are wearing like polar opposite outfits. I'm very white with my white fluffy coat and then mum's wearing lots of black and grey and black. <laughs> so the reason why I'm not, oh my God. <laughs> the reason I'm not wearing a mask is because there's literally no one else around us. I have got my mask here so if someone comes by I'll pop it on. Um, or if someone comes and sits in our bit then I'll put it on. But there's literally like no one around. I mean I'll try and show you that show my mum because my mum's not being on camera but look. So I'm here. There's literally like no one. Street. We're just going to grab something to eat, so I'm pescatarian now. So I've got to try and find a meatless sausage roll because London Liverpool Street do the best sausage rolls. So I need to try and find a meatless one. So as we saw, we got a cab from Liverpool Street to our hotel. We've got the same view as last time, but although me and Mum reckon that it's actually a better view than last time, so we're about to head off to Mum's first surprise. Um, can't say what it is because Mum's right there. But I will show you and tell you when I tell Mum. So. and it's actually starting to rain a little bit so probably not the best timing to do this but you know oh, I was a bit worrying I was a bit worrying are you lost oh oh <laughs> what have I done <laughs> let's try down there we're almost there I thought I was here we were here but we're clearly not here we're at the wrong bridge. <laughs> okay. London Bridge. That's Tower Bridge. So we need to go up. We need to go up. <laughs> We're here. Oh, we Have you got any guesses? Uh, eating one of the sheds. No. It's a Christmas market. <laughs> I got a prawn pad thai. We've got like our own little booth sort of thing, like in the place where you can eat it. This is my lunch. So we're gonna sit and enjoy this now. And then we do some more shopping at the market. But it's really good, isn't it? It's lovely. It's so cozy in here. We have been sat here for about 20 minutes eating our lunch. And it's only now we've just finished and we realize there's actually a heater there that we can switch on ourselves. Quite blinding. <laughs> that was honestly the nicest pad thai me and my mum have ever had. That was amazing. So we've got a hot chocolate now. I'm actually really gutted. He did give us a Christmas cup and I expected a Christmas cup. Oh well. <laughs> that sounds really sad when I say it out loud. So we are now walking back to our hotel room because it is really raining. Um, 
Now, as you guys might not actually be able to see, but it is raining and we don't really want to get wet. So I'm now just gonna lay in bed for a bit because my feet are really hurting. And I think we're gonna watch the final of I'm a Celeb since it was on yesterday, but we missed it. So we're gonna watch it now because it's just on like replay ITV catch up thing. So we're gonna watch that and then I think we're gonna head somewhere for dinner. I had booked GBK up as a surprise as it's one of mine and mum's favorite restaurants for burgers, even though now I'd have to get like a vegetarian one, but that's fine because I already checked the menu and they did like a Beyond Meat burger, which are really nice. I've had them before. That's what I was gonna get. Um, but it's at St. Paul's and we're in like the city of London and I don't quite know the, I think it's like 15 minutes to St Paul's um, which would be a taxi and with like rush hour traffic as well it just makes more sense for us to find something around this place because there's quite a few restaurants around where we are um we've also got a restaurant literally attached to the hotel so we could do that so we just went downstairs we had a little hot chocolate which was really nice um it's dark now so you can see the bridge all lit up oh and the shard over there it was just the top though the top bit so we've come out for dinner this is the restaurant that's actually in our hotel but we actually managed to get the seat outside that has a little fire pit this fire here is a bit um it's a bit mighty so we're a bit scared of us burning our faces off um as <laughs> we're eating so funny <laughs> the people here they don't really understand us and um my mum asked the waiter is it possible to burn your face off like as a joke and he went yes of course <laughs> morning everyone so it's the next day now I didn't really feel much last night because me and my mum we just came back up to the room and just had a chilled night and just watched some TV We're gonna go down and get in a taxi to go to our next destination which mum doesn't know about you have any guesses no 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 right well I'm gonna tell her now because we're gonna get in a cab and I'm gonna have to tell the cab driver and um, then that's gonna be spot rather than hear it from me. Okay, you have no idea. No. None at all. No. Okay, well we're gonna go to Covent Garden. Oh really? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh wow, that'd be cool. Right then everybody. <laughs> Gotta go. Fit check. So I've just got a hot chocolate whilst we're waiting for our taxi. So we just got out of the taxi and we're now here. Got my hot chocolate which has finally cooled down enough for me to drink because it was so hot. garden for some breakfast. I've ordered myself a berry smoothie and I've got this for my breakfast. I've just got eggs royal which is smoked salmon, uh, poached eggs and hollandaise sauce. So we finished with breakfast now and we're just mooching around Covent Garden and just having a look at a few of the shops and looking at all the different like lights and stuff which is really pretty. I have seen these everywhere and they have a Ben's cookies in Covent Garden so I got the five and get two free deal. Wow. I'm gonna try, mum wants the coconut one. There you go, oh it's warm. And I want the white chocolate macadamia nut one which is the first one I got so that'll be right underneath. <laughs> this is my one, white chocolate macadamia nut. Okay, so this trip has taken a very unexpected turn. We saw a um, Harry Potter expedition, like photo expedition, like literally down the road from Covent Garden. So we're doing that because <laughs> I'm a big Harry Potter fan. So interesting. I'll try and get some clips. So 
So we're back now from the Harry Potter expedition. I loved it because I'm a big Harry Potter fan. Mum didn't quite look like she was enjoying no, herself. No, it was good. Walking around. It was good. Oh, okay. It's educational though. Yeah, but I had such a great time. I got a photo on the broomsticks in front of the car. Oh, it was brilliant. We're back by Tower Bridge now, and I've booked us tickets to actually go up Tower Bridge. You can go inside of it. So I'll try and get some footage, but I don't know if I'll be able to get that much. This was one of the other surprises that I booked for my mum, but my mum actually guessed it because um, we've walked past it so many times my mum actually said about how she thought I'd booked it. And then I started grinning, which gave it away. So we're going up, we're taking the stairs, and there's 260 steps. So um, we have a choice of the lift, but they said that we will miss stuff, so we're doing the stairs. We're at like the really tiny bit of Tower Bridge. And it's all inside so I feel a little more secure because I have like a really 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 bad fear of heights and I've been really nervous about this part because I thought they were gonna ring us up here but it's not as bad as what I thought because we're all enclosed oh look we can open the window oh the window's already open it's like squid game for me they've got a glass bit where you can walk over but I'm not doing that look Ugh. I'm gonna stick to this side um, mum's a lot more brave than me at least I can look at it this time, which before it made me feel really sick. <laughs> so the bit where they just took us up is that bit of the bridge. So normally when we walk across, we're walking across that bit. But the last bit of footage was there and then like the glass bit was there, which I could not walk on. Um, yeah, I thought they might have done that. I booked it for my mum's birthday surprise because we wanted to do it last time. And it was only today that I twigged. Oh, I think it's gonna be them tall bits. Thought it was just going up like the castle-y looking bits. Wasn't. Um, I enjoyed walking up. No, I didn't enjoy walking up there though. <laughs> that was hard work, but it was interesting. Like the things on the walls about who made it and who helped build it and stuff. But no, that tall bit wasn't fun. So we're now on the train home. It's about half four and yeah, I'm very tired. And I thought I'd end the vlog here since we're now leaving London. You can see that it's dark everywhere, so there's not really much to see to be in it. Oh, I do quickly want to show you my rings though, hold on. My mum bought me this really nice ring from one of the Christmas market. And also this Harry Potter one, which I love. It's very apt for today. But yes, we both had a really nice time in London, but we're both very tired. So <laughs> I'm going to end the vlog here. Thank you so much for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.